In his address, the president spelled out new measures that included a review of the nationwide task to don curfew effective immediately. Now, the nationwide curfew is extended up to the 3rd of January 2021. That beginning tonight, the 4th of November, the curfew will now be enforced between 10 p.m. and 4 a.m. in the morning. Business establishments, including bars and restaurants, were ordered to close at 9 p.m. And with an increase in political gatherings, the president announced a suspension of all public rallies for two months. And anyone wishing to hold such meetings should do so in town halls. And in doing so, must observe all COVID protocols, including limiting the attendees to one-third seating capacity of the hall and the wearing of face masks. He also challenged leaders to lead by example, ordering cabinet secretaries to scale down person-to-person -person engagements. He also revealed basic education in person learning will resume in the new year, while grade four learners and candidates will health safety measures, and with that, also order that all basic education classes resuming in-person learning in January of 2021. The president further launched the No Mask, No Service campaign, urging the private sector to follow suit. I call on the private sector to join the government in the public sensitization campaign dubbed No Mask, No Service. This comes as the number of COVID-19 cases has risen to 58,587 after 1,494 people tested positive from a sample size of 8,839. The number of fatalities also increased to 1,051 after 12 more people succumbed to the contagion. 586 patients have recovered, pushing the total of recoveries to 38,381. Nancy Okware, Channel 1 News.